Hey, guys and gals, A here. Welcome to another episode of EDCQ. So today we are talking sling bag, very small sling bag. Maybe the smallest sling bag I own. You wanna know what it is and if it's even useful, come on back because here we go. All right, guys and gals. So if you've watched many of my videos, you've probably come across some alpaca gear. I like alpaca gear. They have one of my favorite sling bags of all time, which is the Tech Case, not the Mini, not the Max, the original. I freaking love the Elements Tech Case. It is, in my opinion, one of the best bags you can get. That is a sling crossbody, like wear it on your rib, wear it on your back, pull it around to the front to access your stuff kind of bag. It's perfect. It rides well, it carries a lot of gear, stays slim, looks cool, lots of pockets for organization. It's excellent. Uh, they also make some excellent, awesome pouches. They have uh, the hub pouch, which is great. Um, I believe they have the utility pouch and the admin, just lots of different kinds of pouches. And the hub pouch is super small, lots of organization as all of these are. And the cool thing about them is they have tons of organization without being tactical. Um, they have tons of sling bags. The ghost sling is an excellent line. Uh, the tech case has tons of different sizes. They have backpacks, they have cross body, just all kinds of stuff. And I haven't been disappointed in any of it. They're made of high quality materials. They're, they're made well. I haven't had any break or tear on me or loose threads. So just really impressed with it. So when I saw a vertical sling bag, I knew I had to try it. So today we are talking about the modular sling. And now if you want any alpaca gear stuff, save yourself 15%. Use the code I have down below. It'll save you 1515. Uh, and that's a chunk of change on some of this. That, that definitely helps. And so uh, grab that below, use it on any of your purchases at alpaca, enjoy them, tell me about them, send me pictures, I love it. But so this is the modular sling. It is a vertical um, pouch bag. So I have the, um, the bag attachment on here and it attaches to these little loops right here. You do not have to carry it as a bag. You can actually, so it has, we'll start here. So it has two little Velcro straps right here that run with the bag being horizontal. So you could put this on your belt and carry it as a hip pouch and you could adjust the, the zippers accordingly for that. Um, you could also put this on your bag strap. So if you're carrying a backpack, you could put these straps right here, these straps right here on that strap or even on your cross body bag and have this as a quick access pack. Um, that's a great way to carry this, honestly. If you're carrying like a larger messenger bag, sling bag, cross body bag, backpack, you just, uh, these un -Velcro. And so you put your strap through there and then Velcro this over it. And it gives you a nice pouch, you know, sitting wherever your strap is. So this gives you quick access to a few items, be an excellent way to carry it. We also have this vertical strap running. And so what you do here is you can um, pull this and run it on the outside of this. And now you could run your belt through it and have this as a waste pack. Um, you could thread this through the molly or any sort of loop or attachment point on your messenger bag, backpack, whatever it is. So very modular, lots of ways to carry it. My preferred way is just like this. You put the strap on. And now this is a, I've, I've shown this before, but I really like it. So this strap right here, you squeeze the two plastic pieces together and you slide this metal piece away and it comes on and off literally just that simply. So you slide it on, you squeeze these two pieces to, oh, I'm off camera, squeeze these two plastic pieces together, slide the metal clip on, and we're connected again. So super easy, you could definitely use this um, on a backpack or a messenger bag and put the strap inside of the, ba the larger bag you're carrying, use this for your quick access items, and then decide you wanna carry this, take the strap out, pop it on, you're ready to rock and roll with just this. However it works for you, 
and it's a nice, very thin, one inch wide uh, seat belt strap. So just what you need for this. It's not too big. Uh, it's um, very thin. You're not gonna carry a bunch of weight on this. If you were, this would not be near as comfortable because it would probably cut into your neck. But because this is gonna be a lighter weight pack based upon the size, um, this works out wonderfully. I carry it on my right shoulder, which leaves it hanging down on my left hip. I love it that way, it works out well. Um, obviously carry it how fits you. And then let's look at what this thing can hold. So the front compartment right here is magnetized. That's one of the key features of the modular sling here. It is a magnetized pocket right there. You've got um, uh, weatherproof material fabric here that is uh, made in the USA, which is awesome. And you've got your YKK zippers along with this um, weather tech guard around it. So it keeps it really dry, really like this right here. Now I keep in this front compartment, my wallet, which is a great spot, really quick access for it. It will also hold your cell phone depending upon size. And it is kind of an accordion little pouch here. So it does expand to hold larger things. And we have the high vis interior. So whatever you want that will fit in here, this will work for quick access items that you don't mind a magnet being near. And it's not a heavy duty magnet, but it works to keep the flap closed. Now, the main opening of this compartment comes nearly all the way down. So this thing is an excellent bag to open up. It does accordion out and it has these here to stop it from opening all the way. One thing to note about these is they do go all the way down. So if you were to drop change or something small in there, you would not have to worry about them falling out the bottom because that is sewn into the bottom of the bag. So this is kind of the layout in here. Inside the middle compartment, I just have a little small boo-boo kit. Um, and there's your high-vis interior. You see you have this area here where you can carry a lot of stuff. We have a slip pocket in the back. This is the side near you. And inside this slip pocket, I just have a couple things. I have some wet wipes and then my uh, goodies pouch. Actually, I have two of those. So if we got headaches or dirty hands, we're good to go. And that is not high vis. This is a nice soft material on this side. So you could put your phone, you know, potentially in here, it would have to be slim, but something slim back here will work well. Like my whole hand fits in there. Um, great pocket. And then the, the front side of the bag here, we actually have some organization going on. So here we have, uh, and oh, I'm just gonna pull the lid off. So inside of here, I can get it out, that'd be awesome. I have my lip balm, which is obnoxiously big, but this is a Sasquatch lip balm, which is freaking cool. I love Bigfoot. And then uh, I have in the same little area, I have a titanium I3T EOS. And then that is in an elastic loop right here. Let's see if I can show you that. So there's an elastic loop right there in front. You can see it right here. So there are two elastic loops on the other side. I have a knife sitting in that elastic loop and that is the uh, PM2, I believe. And uh, excellent knife. So over on this side, we have a slip compartment in the back that runs just like on the other side. In front of that slip compartment, we have, see if I can do it this way so you can see it. We have two elastic loops right there. And so on one side, I have my knife. On the other, I have flashlight and uh, chapstick. And then we also have a pocket here in the bottom. And it's a very small pocket, but since I'm using the elastic straps, that's actually where that stuff goes down into. You can see you can't see any more of the flashlight than the top because it's down in that pocket. Um, so you kind of use one or the other. You, you're either using the straps and then you're using the pocket in conjunction with it, or you're just using the pocket. Um, but you can't really utilize both of those. However, you can still put stuff in the back of here, even using those elastic straps and pockets. I like the bag. So this, this is what the bag's for, in my opinion. Small, everyday carry. So you can carry stuff in here but you're not gonna carry a ton. You can carry more than I have. I have this bag very under stuffed. Like it's, no, it's nowhere near anything that would be considered stuffed. 
it's very lightweight it's small it has what i want and it's very usable for me you can add significantly more to this but it's still going to limit you in what you carry you're going to carry your essentials you're going to carry the things you want and nothing else like you're not going to have room to throw every little thing you think of into here and to me that's the appeal so many bags that i have are large bags and I can put stuff just in case or because I have the room. That's not the case here. Here, you're really narrowing down. What do I want? What do I need? What do I value? And then you're carrying those items. And that's what I like about it, the simplicity of it. The, the fact that it's all quick access because there's not a ton of stuff in here. I don't have to dig around for it. And I do have a little extra room in case I do want to throw something else in here. I think this bag would excel as like your, I'm gonna be out for the day and I want my electronic stuff with me. So you could keep your phone in here, you could keep a battery bank in here, you could keep charging cables in here, that sort of thing. This would work really well. An EDC kit, kind of like what I have. Your man purse where you're holding those few essential items that you want to carry but you don't want in your pockets. Whatever it is, this works great but it's minimal. I love it. This is the modular swing by Alpaca Gear. Comes in at $55. Link below to save yourself 15%. Definitely check that out. Use it on any of your Alpaca Gear. Enjoy. Get a small kickback for the channel, which will go into buying more gear and doing more reviews. Thanks for hanging out with me, guys and gals. This has been a blast. I will be back with new content soon. And remember, EDC, EDC.